Well, Camp Ripley is leading the way in energy efficiency and renewable energy by partnering with Minnesota Power and installing 62 acres of solar panels on the base. The project is well underway and over halfway done. Our Logan Gay toured the construction site to learn more about the project. Camp Ripley's energy efficiency and renewable energy project is one of a kind. As of right now, this is the largest National Guard base uh, solar project in, in, the, in the state and in the country. The project is a partnership between Camp Ripley and Minnesota Power and has been in the works for almost three years. The project serves several different purposes for the base. In the event of, a, of an emergency, we're going to have the ability to, to shut down and kind of isolate ourselves from the grid. And having that 10 megawatt solar array is a very important piece of that, um, of that puzzle. And then the second thing is just it's important for us to, to, uh, to fulfill our environmental goals. Um, and having this renewable source on site and, and reducing our carbon footprint, that's, that's very important to us as an organization. The solar field is located on the base atop 62 acres of land and produces energy equivalent of 2,000 homes. Solar panels that we're using are thin film uh, technology made by First Solar in Ohio and they're manufactured in the United States and uh, they're a little bit different than typical solar panels. Um, in that they don't use uh, cells, they actually use a, a film instead of cells. One unique thing about these panels is that they are able to gather energy in several different weather types. Because they're a little, uh, little sleeker and they don't have a metal frame around the outside, so the snow will fall off a little easier. And the construction of the solar field project is 75% complete. In Little Falls, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. Camp Ripley will celebrate the completion of the solar project with a ribbon cutting ceremony in September. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.